Hey, scholars, welcome back. Another Wednesday afternoon in Achieve Land. Hope your day has gone well. A free ride to school is today's article. Before I do that, though, I want to just shout out uh, everybody here at Vista. Um, almost half of all students have completed 40 articles since the beginning of the school year. That's great news. Um, it's going to help us with our SBAC scores, and hopefully you'll see your Lexile score moving up. Uh, today's article is going to take place in India, and specifically in the state of Bihar, which is in the northeast corner of India. Uh, its population is 104 million people. One in three are illiterate, which means they can't read. 47% of women are illiterate, and 60% of girls marry by the age of 18. Uh, it's a very poor state. Girls are taught how to cook and how to take care of younger siblings. Um, at a very young age. Many of them, as you just read, are married by the time they're 18. Until recently, schooling focused on boys only. In the past 30 years, however, more and more girls started attending school in Bihar. Still, there are strong cultural reasons why most girls stop going to school around the ages of 10 to 12. And another reason is economics. Many families can't afford the bus fare to ride the 10 mile trip to most schools. So 10 years ago, the government of Bihar gave girls bikes to ride to school. Now more and more girls are getting a high school education like Nahid Farzana, who you'll read about in the article. Hope you enjoy the video. Have a great day, scholars. The prevailing mindset is that my goat is an asset and my girl is a liability. And it's really about changing that mindset. First and foremost, in every village where we enter, we find a community volunteer. Our volunteers are young, they're educated, they're passionate. They themselves really want to see a change. They go door to door and they find every single girl who's out of school. Then they actually sit with the community and make community-based enrollment plans for bringing these girls back into school. So then our Team Balika volunteers come inside the government school classroom and they run a remedial in Hindi, English and Math to make sure that all children, girls and boys, are actually achieving the learning outcomes required. It's about every single girl coming to school. It's about every single girl contributing to the changing world. It's about every single girl contributing to the change in the family. And it's about every single girl contributing to the changes in community at large. We are talking about better health, better income. We are talking about better education. So it's for every single child. There's like 50, 60 percent of the girls in Rajasthan who are married below the age of 18 nationwide. That child marriage percentage is very high. Um, a lot of the children, also about 10 to 15 percent, that are married below the age of 10. My marriage was 14 years old. I was studying in the 8th grade. After studying in the 8th grade, they told me that फिर जैसे ही मेरा मार्कशीट आई उन्होंने मना कर दिया कि हम अब आपकी लड़की को नहीं पढ़ाना चाहते और हम पढ़ाएंगे भी नहीं टीचर बनना चाहते हैं और सारी लड़कियों को पढ़ाना चाहते हैं हिम्मत भी आती है और पैसे भी मिलते और पैसे भी मिलते तो मम्मी पापा को भी देते
In the last 10 years, I'm really proud to say that we have found and brought back to school 150,000 out-of-school girls that are now connected and are attending school and learning.